Hello my dear students, today we will start session 8, Monday 4th of May, we will continue lesson 3, Waves and Sound part 4 by Dr. Marie. Last time we were talking about transverse waves and longitudinal waves and we said that sound waves are compressional waves. What the meaning of compressional wave? Compressional wave produced by vibrations, which is the movement of wave in matter, and the molecules in the medium, the medium we said either solid, liquid, or gas, move back and forth. And we said that the sound waves are very fast in the solid medium. So how does sound travel? We said that this is a transverse wave and this is the longitudinal wave and the sound waves are example of longitudinal wave or compressional wave. And we said that while the tuning fork is working, it produces sound waves and the direction of travel is in this direction. So how does sound travel? We said that the waves of the tuning fork can be studied by oscilloscope. What the meaning of oscilloscope? Oscilloscope is a device that is used to display and analyze the waves produced from the tuning fork, like you are seeing right now. So, what the meaning of echo? Echo is reflected sound waves. So, when the source of sound produces sound waves, it falls on any surface and it bounces back or the sound reflects back. This is called echo. What are the uses of echo? We learned in grade 4 about the sonar and the sonar is the abbreviation of sound navigation and ranging. Sonar uses sound waves or echoes to do what? Number one, to locate unseen objects underwater. Number two, fishers use sonar to locate schools of fish in order to hunt a lot of fish like this. It pre uh, sends sound waves and the sound wave is re reflected by echoes to locate the unseen objects under water. As well, the sonar is used to locate the fetus in the womb. So, in order to locate the fetus in the womb, we use sonar. Okay, it uses high frequency sound waves reflect of the baby tissue in the womb. Right now, we finished our session. Thank you so much, my beloved students. See you tomorrow in a new session. Goodbye. Dr. Marie was with you.